one of several young players brought through this season by the South Melbourne coach Danny Wright, a coach who's not afraid to go for youth. The mistake made there by Kis Norbo. Chance here for the Kings. Blahos still looking for his first goal of the season. Andy Blahos. Chimboli. Good ball in behind. Taylor. It's picked out. Coveney Bullion making the movement towards the middle. And that is a superb piece of defending there from Jonathan Perry. A few rather optimistic claims from the fans for a penalty. It never was. But it doesn't look good for Vaughan Coveney at the moment. Erlovich. Ball finding its way through to Vlahos. Atkinson with the early ball in. Almendra going for the spectacular overhead. It's Burton on the far side who hooks it back into the middle. And Almendra, the shortest man on the edge of that area, somehow got the header on target. So trouble here for the Kings, some 20 metres or so out from goal, directly in front. Michael Udding sets the wall. He's got five players in there, defending the goal as Souza, Joko Souza celebrates his home debut with a wonder goal for South Melbourne. A superb strike there from Souza. Beats it past the wall, past the goalkeeper, and it's South Melbourne who take the lead. Well, it had to be a good free kick, Michael, because the form we've seen Michael adding in this season, he could have stopped that. He's been saving everything, but not even the great man, Michael Lanning, could get his outstretched arm to that. He is on fire at the moment, Souza. He's making it all happen for South Melbourne. Bullion. Sekolovsky on that right touch line. As Souza inside. Panopoulos now. Sekolovsky onside, no flag, early ball in, danger here, Trimboli, one touch, still Trimboli! The crowd comes alive, Paul Trimboli adds a second, the Kings in all sorts of trouble now. And Paul Trimboli, a sweet strike for his second goal of the season. The Kings perhaps guilty there of ball watching. They just took too long to close down the man and Trimboli makes them pay. Souza Damianos, perhaps Trimboli in there as well, Panopolis, and that makes South Melbourne perhaps title contenders, really. Yeah, they've got plenty. They've got experience and they've got quality, haven't they? Plenty of troops, plenty of good quality football. Well, chance here for Vlahos, flag stays down. Well, that is the difference between the two sides. Great save from Galekovic. But in the meantime, South Melbourne come away with the ball. Here is the man of the moment, Jelko Souza. Bullion. Souza. Terrible defending from the King. Souza in open space. Clips it over the goalkeeper. And unfortunately for Souza, wide of the mark there. Flahos again. Almendra, lovely return ball from Almendra. Vlahos, chance here for Erlovich. And again, Galekovic makes the save. Well, the Kings are wasting their opportunities. And Paul Erlovich, well, he should have buried that one. Slides it through, but Vlahos, well, he made the mistake, but he made up for it. And that is an important issue for any coach. Vlahos recovering his own mistake. Shot comes in from Burton. And that was just millimetres wide from Mark Burton. Delekovic scrambling across his goal. The ball passed the goalkeeper, but sadly for the Kings, also passed the frame of the goal. Much better stuff, though, from Mark Burton. Inside was Souza. And if he can find Diomitis on that far side, there is plenty of room to move. Diomitis does get possession of the ball. Perhaps holds onto it too long, Diomitis. Souza. Danger here for the Kings. 
Ibrahim, the substitute, and again desperate defending from Miyazawa. Been around the National League now and New Zealand football for a number of years, but he's doing his stuff well today. Here's Campbell. Lajos peels off to the left. Burton now with Di Gregorio, the room for Atkinson, who needs now to get a good ball into the middle. Can't do so. Hits the first man in Demetrius. Gets a second chance, Mark Atkinson. Deep cross this time. Brought down by Almendra. And he went for perhaps a clever option there rather than the power. Patricio Almendra. It didn't pay off. A beautiful turn. Di Gregorio, the man to defuse the situation. Souza. Kiss Norbo has moved forward. Looking for Bullion. Trimboli, surely Paul Trimboli, and he grabs the second of the game. That is the ball game as far as the Kings are concerned. South Melbourne extend the lead. Three goals now for the home side. Two of them from Paul Trimboli. And South Melbourne having weathered some pressure in the early stages of the second half. Come back at the other end. From this point on, you would imagine it's an impossible task for the Kings. Well, Almendra tangles with Souza, and Di Gregorio is in there as the enforcer, and players are now coming in from everywhere, and Brett Hugo has to sort things out. Souza, with his blood boiling, Almendra is the player on the ground. The referee will need to sort this out. And Joko Souza is in a bit of trouble, but it's only a yellow card for the South Melbourne midfielder. Erlovich. Atkinson. Almendra. Vlahos. Down goes Burton, and that's a penalty. The referee had a good look at that. Mark Burton goes to ground. A penalty to the Kings, perhaps a lifeline. There's 13 minutes remaining. We talked about Mission Impossible. And Tolios and Panopoulos went for the ball. Burton went to ground. Well, it looks like an accidental clash there. I can't really complain with the referee's decision that the attacking team was certainly disadvantaged by that clash, that, that intervention from Nick Tolios. Very difficult to comment on intent. Here's the replay again. That's a penalty. I think the referee's done a good job in this instance. A lifeline for the Kings. Almendra steps up and a save from Delekovic and a second save from the goalkeeper. Eugene Delekovic can take a bow. Superb athleticism there from the young goalkeeper. And Patricio Almendra is the golden opportunity from the spot. And it's been that sort of evening for the Kings. As the referee is again in the middle of it. It's a second card in the matter of minutes for Souza. The Kings have a couple of weeks to ponder it. As the full-time whistle goes here at the Bob Jane Stadium. It's been an eventful evening, but one which ends without reward for the Kings. Two goals from Paul Trimboli, another from Jelko Souza, enough to see off the Kings.